so in the earlier video we had a discussion about the anthrax okay complete that was a complete discussion about anthrax uh, in the first part of the anthrax video so this is the second part of the anthrax video and here we will discuss about the anthracoids so first question is what are those anthracoids anthracoids are all the bacillus species all the bacillus species are called as anthracoids except the bacillus anthracis so suppose this is bacillus anthracis and these are all other species and these are all other species of the bacillus okay all other species of the bacillus and this is bacillus anthracis so if we leave this bacillus anthracis all these other bacillus species are called as the anthracoids okay all other bacillus species except the bacillus anthracis are collectively called as the anthracoids these are collectively called as the anthracoids anthracoids means anthra anthrax and oids the meaning of oids is like like anthrax okay the meaning of the meaning of oids is like and anthrax means anthrax so anthrax like that means anthrax likes are the all other bacilli species except the bacillus anthracis are collectively called as anthrax what are the example of anthracoids so anthracoids include the bacillus cereus bacillus thuringiensis geobacillus stearothermophilus and bacillus atrophius bacillus cereus causes food poisoning that is an important point about the bacillus cereus bacillus thuringiensis is uh, can is used as the uh, you know as the larvicidal agent larvicidal agent for killing the mosquito um, for killing the mosquito larvas geobacillus stearothermophilus is used as the uh, control used as a control of the auto control uh, sorry autoclave uh, sterilization method and bacillus atrophius is used as the control of the dry heat sterilizer method okay that is the some of the important points about these anthracoids about the bacillus cereus it is a uh, causing food poisoning bacillus thuringiensis is used as larvicidal of the mosquitoes uh, geobacillus stearothermophilus is used as control for autoclave and bacillus atrophius is used for control of the dry heat sterilizer now how will we remember the properties of the anthracoids i have very simplified this to uh, how you how you can remember the property of the anthracoids this is very simple mnemonic by the name of anthracoids itself you can remember the uh, all the important points about the anthracoids so see i have written here anthracoids okay anthracoids with penicillin anthracoid with penicillin i have written now what is the meaning of a a means it is arranged in short chains what is the meaning of n n means it is non pathogenic except bacillus cereus which causes food poisoning what is the meaning of t t means it produces turbidity in broth and if it produces turbidity if any bacteria produces turbidity in a broth that means the motility is present in that bacteria and if motility is present in the in that bacteria that means it has got some flagella also okay so turbidity in broth indirectly means the motility is present and once the motility is present that means there is flagella and h means hemolytic colonies which causes uh, that means it causes beta hemolysis on blood agar r means rapid liquefaction of gelatin so since it causes rapid liquefaction of gelatin so we cannot see any inverted for tree appearance into the gelatin stab agar ac means it is there is absence of capsule there is no capsule in these anthracoids and oids with penicillin now if you clear if you see this o i d then you can see it the same uh, you know uh, letters uh, o i d okay so if you add s here and l here so it will become solid media with penicillin okay it will become solid media with penicillin that means on the solid media with penicillin it shows no growth but the but the bacillus anthracis bacillus anthracis produces a string of pearl appearance so this is this differentiates it from the bacillus anthracis so by the name of the anth by the name or uh, by the anthracoid name itself you can remember all the features these are all the features 
of the nth records included in this short mnemonic you can remember all the features in this short mnemonic okay of the anthracoids a4 arranged in short chains and for non pathogenic except the bacillus cereus t4 turbidity in broad motility is turbidity is broad is present means motility is also present motility present means flagella is also present h for hemolytic colonies on that is beta hemolysis on blood agar r for it causes rapid liquefaction of gelatin so no inverted for to appears ac means there is absence of capsule means anthracoids lack capsule but and uh, oids with penicillin if you add s and l then it becomes solid media with penicillin there of course no growth so this this is all feature these are all the features of the anthracoids you can remember very easily with the mnemonic of anthracoid itself next you will see the difference and i have simplified the difference as well you will love to remember the difference in my way so see my next video that is the difference between the anthrax and the anthracoids